Business owners often come to me with a question of what type of a legal entity should my business be? And there's some confusion as to the legal entity and the tax filings. As an individual, if you have a business, your options are to file a 1040 as a Schedule C. You may want to look at other legal entities as a LLC or a corporation, which offer limited liability protection for you, but certainly you should talk to your legal advisor about what your liability is and how that protects you. If you've made the decision to be a corporation, then the filings that you have are by default a C corporation, or you may make an election to be an S corporation. S corporations have a little bit different tax structure than a C corporation, and so obviously you want to look at what are the advantages and disadvantages of each. As an LLC, by definition, if you are by yourself, you're the only member in this LLC, and you haven't made an election, the IRS looks at you as what's called a disregarded entity, which means you don't file a separate tax return. You should revert back to being an individual and filing all the business information on your personal return, a Schedule C. But an LLC has an option to be taxed as a C corporation if you elect, or it may file as an S corporation. If you have two members in the LLC, then by default, you're going to file a partnership return. You may also, as I said, file as an S corporation or a C corporation. So what happens as an LLC, a lot of times a business will start out and it will be a disregarded entity because there's one owner, file as a Schedule C, and then at some point realize that from a tax point of view, the filing would be better as a S corporation or a C corporation. It's a very simple process to move from a Schedule C into an S corporation or a C corporation. And that's the legal entity versus the tax filing. <laughs>